Hey everyone, welcome to the first ever episode of Dice Decides episode where I let a dice decide what season in episode of a TV show I'm going to be watching. Today we're going to be getting into Grey's Anatomy. Now Grey's is like one of those shows that I indirectly know a lot about but I've never watched it before. I just know a lot of things about it because I had some friends who watched it. Everybody's always talking about it on social media, especially on Twitter. So I do know a little bit about the characters, about the plot, about everything that Miss Meredith Grey gets up to but in general I don't know everything so if I get any characters names wrong or anything please please don't get at me in the comments okay I'm gonna be using Google's d20 dice to decide and just so y'all know that I'm not cheating I'm gonna go ahead and screen record and I won't do like any cuts right here in this section so let's go ahead and roll this dice I hope we get a good season and a good episode so we got season four episode episode five Hopefully this is like a juicy episode. I don't know, maybe there's something going on at the hospital. Maybe Meredith has to check somebody or maybe, I don't know, there's a little smoochy smoochy smoo up in the like storage room closet. I don't know. Hopefully it's not a boring like filler episode because girl, I feel like there's 20 episodes per season with Grey's Anatomy. But let's go ahead and head over to Netflix. So we are here. Let's see, season four episode five let's see what it says on it oh it's a halloween episode so on halloween alex receives an unexpected visit from a former patient and meredith thinks her mother's ashes are haunting her oh wow i love that it is almost halloween and we're getting a halloween episode this is freaking perfect do you think i should watch the recap previously on oh Anatomy. yeah i'll George watch the recap oh oh my god that's um Miss Cullen, what's her name? Oh, I know who that is, but I don't remember her name. But I know that she's iconic. And that's Mr. McDreamy? Or Steamy? Girl. Dreamy. Any yes. more questions about my dead mother or can we get back to work? Oh. Meredith is a mess. I don't know this is how Meredith gets down. Pick me. Choose me. Love, Love me. me. See? That's the only quote that I actually know out of this whole thing. Pick me. Choose me. Love me. Does he end up loving her? I don't know. I wonder, okay, if I love Grey's Anatomy, I may start from the beginning or I may keep this for our episode decides. I'm not, I'm not really sure. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. If I like Grey's Anatomy, I'll continue watching it, but I'm definitely going to like let this be one of the TV shows that I do for Dice Decides. So we'll see. Imagine my disappointment when I wake up after five years and discover that you're no more than ordinary. Oh, is that her mom? Oh, that must be her mom since we're talking about it. Is she about to go? Please tell me why this lady's about to go visit her mom at the morgue. Is that what's about to happen? Meredith, girl. Are her decisions like very questionable? Because it's looking like it. Because I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that. Oh no, that's her. Okay. This is very camp. That's really haunting her, huh? Do they all live together? Or... Was that her daughter? Y'all let me know. Because don't they all work at the hospital? Is those her mama's ashes? My mother. I... Happy freaking Halloween. Okay. My wife has filed for divorce. <laughs> why are you telling me this? Are they good friends or something? But like, honestly, why are you telling me this? Also, why are you stalking her actions? Sir, who are you? <laughs> who is that? Seriously. I want to look up the um, cast and the names of these people so badly, but I feel like it's more exciting to just like go with the flow, you know, and take it as it comes. And I may just give names to people. <laughs> I'm very sorry, sir. At any rate, I need a place to live. Oh, and that's why he was place, asking. I, 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 no, it's still Burke's place. Is Burke alive? What's yours? Oh, girl, is that how people get apartments? I need to do that. He said that was easy. I had to get her out of my closet. She was haunting me. And now she's haunting us all. <laughs> she's Gorge. Who is that? Ooh, that's my girl. She's still on the show, right? She's been there since the beginning. Are most of these people right here in the shot dead? Because I know that um, Grey's Anatomy likes to kill off a lot of people. Why is Stevens directing her questions to Dr. Bailey? Because she's been sleeping with my husband. <gasps> Ready then. Ooh, this okay. is juicy. Who is that queen? <laughs> Dr. Rayleigh with the stuck face. Who is that? And is she dating the guy that's next to her? Because, okay, again, why were they at... Was that Meredith's house? Who house was that? 
I need, I have burning questions, but again, I just want to go with the flow and I'll learn things as it comes, but ooh, awkward. <laughs> Don't run now. You know, also the show is a lot more funny than I was expecting. I thought it was more like a drama, but it's giving, it's giving soap opera funny, if that makes sense. Are you the doctor? No, I am. Good. Is your leg hurting you? <laughs> it's, it's not the leg. It's the foot. It's like, and, sir, and it's why are we? So much as, as it's I not was mine. dancing right now. Wait, what did he just say? Let me go back. It's it's not the leg. Okay, it's the foot. It's the foot. And, and? and it's not hurting so much as, as it's not mine. That's what I thought it said. Why is that not yours? It, 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 it feels like it's a corpse foot. Oh, they're really leaning into the whole Halloween aspect, right? I'm not crazy. I, I, I work in you a bank. You sure about that? Because you work in a bank, <laughs> you're not crazy. A surgeon who will remove it. Sir, you said you're not crazy because you work in a bank, but you just came up to a random doctor at the hospital talking about, I need you to remove my foot. So remind me again where you're not crazy. Surgeon who will remove your foot. Exactly. A surgeon who will amputate your seemingly healthy foot. Exactly. He said, yep, that's it. You got it. <laughs> oh, Meredith. Oh, she ran into her man. Oh, it? it's her Jones. mother. Meredith. It's my mom. Oh, I had her in the car. Do you think that's disrespectful to leave her in the car? And Meredith, she's all over the floor now. They're just literally just scooping up <laughs> her mom off the floor. Are those really your mom's ashes? Where'd that little cake come from? Right? It's strange. <gasps> oh you... my God. That's what's his name, Dylan? What's his last name? Okay, I might look this up. Dylan, he's in that band, Wallows, right? He's been acting for a long time, huh? Let me see, Wallows band, and the members. Yeah, Dylan Minette. I'm sorry if I got that wrong, but that's definitely Dylan as a little kid. Ooh, Don't Dr. McSteamy. We're on to you, we've compared notes. Oh, he's sleeping with everybody, huh? Compared notes? Compared well, you can come over this way. Techniques. Oh, techniques. There's techniques. At least he's consistent. Against Mark Sloan. Oh, he's Mark Sloan. I never knew his name. Last thing I watched him in was Euphoria and Bad Boys 4. Yep. Daddy? <gasps> Not daddy. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he paid him to do it. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Wait, this is so much funnier than I thought. But I am hoping to build me some meals. Oh, what kind of, um, what's his practice? Are they all surgeons, right? Surgeons stand up through 10, 12, 15 hour surgeries without food, without bathroom breaks, without complaints. Surgeons really? do not go home because we have a tickle in our throat. Ooh, I would not want to be a surgeon. Oh, wasn't he just talking about everything that surgeons do and now he's trying to get busy with the, just a little sheet in front of them? Is this how they get down? Is this what Bailey was doing, Dr. Bailey, with that lady's husband? Because... They're just asking to get caught. Dr. Sloan, I feel sorry for me to do the surgery for free. Oh. Uh, okay, like that. This requires OR time. And instant okay, knowledge. make it work. A general surgeon to remove the cartilage from your ribs. He's at like, least I knew all that. So let's make it work. And the other doctors don't owe me any favors because I've never done any for them. Oh, oh so I'm he's sorry. just kind of like a horrible person. I wish I could help. He could just ask around. Come on, Dr. Sloan. Meredith to the rescue. I have social capital. Does she? Do the people love Meredith? I've always wondered that, especially since she's been at the hospital for so long. Oh, does she work there? Is she like allowed to be back there? Lady, I thought you just came because there's something wrong. Now you guys are somewhere like in a bunk. What is that? I Isn't he on the job? Is he on break? Out. Is this what they do? I get, I get that. <laughs> no, seriously, let's pause real quick. Is this how they get down? At Gray's Hospital or whatever the hospital is called. Girl, I don't even know what the hospital is called. Because don't you guys have a job to do? Weren't you just like scolding that one girl to make her like to get the medicine before she whatever, whatever he was talking about. That. So why are you somewhere in a room kissing this random lady off the street? Well, I'm guessing this is like your girlfriend. <laughs> but to me, she's a random lady off the street. Why aren't you doing your job? Do they actually get work done here or do they just like talk about getting work done? Do they show them in surgery? Because uh, it's giving that they don't. <laughs> it's 
giving, I'm just here for the drama. It's giving, am I the drama? But no, but seriously, why, why are they, why are they trying to get busy when he should be, when he's at work? Because if I were to do this while I was at work, we'd be getting fired. Also, speaking of fired, why didn't Dr. Bailey get fired and she's sleeping with that man's husband? That's probably against the code of conduct. I thought you would come for me. Why does she keep saying you would come for I me? I came back for you. Like in what way? Where has she been? Makes me a beggar. Oh, not a beggar. A oh, but girl, you showed up there. So maybe let's stop begging. Again, is he on break? Because if not, he needs to get back to work. Somebody needs their meds. The man is requesting an amputation and the best you can come up with is anti-anxiety meds. <laughs> the man can hear you. Dr. Bailey? Oh, she's Dr. Bailey. What? Oh. Who's the other lady? I've been saying Dr. Bailey this whole time. And that's my sister right here. Get me a surgeon. I Sir, am a calm surgeon. Down. And try this medication. She, please, try this and get out of my face. <laughs> Sir, stop stomping. I feel like he also stomped the wrong foot right then. My mother, she was big on pro bono surgeries. I didn't know that hospitals did pro bono surgeries. That's really nice. Oh, our two is free at 6 p.m. Thank you. Aww, <laughs> it was so easy. So the girl Aaron I like is Shannon, Kelly. Who are they? Her father's on three. He's waiting for a new heart. <gasps> Not that that was that girl that was um criticizing her just earlier in the episode. Ooh, life comes at you fast. <laughs> hits you like a brick. <laughs> Sorry, I had to. Oh, you have the finger? Yeah, but it's like lodged in the chainsaw. Wait, it was right here. my chainsaw? How do you lose a chainsaw? Wait, someone actually has a chainsaw? What goes on in this hospital? Oh my god! Wait, I was not expecting that. I should have. That's so clever. I should have known. Oh my god. Y'all, what is this show? It's so much more like fun than I thought it was. But okay, let's see that this man successfully cuts off his leg. Or, oh my god, do you think it's gonna be a different color? And it's so fake because he would. <gasps> Until you're nervous, shot, there's nothing sound about him. Completely mangled. Can't believe I held that Sato's leg long enough. Was he high? So he actually yeah, did it? I didn't think he actually yeah, did it. Because the way that he was just like, ah! It was so fake. Her limbs don't sit well with me. Just a little queasy is all. It don't sit well with me either. Ooh. I get that you can wake up one day and your life doesn't feel like your own. I was agree. that her husband or boyfriend? Match on oh, husband. And if there's anything you need yeah. me to do to cheer you up, I'm around. Is he the hospital whore? Day or night. <laughs> Not day or night. Wait, I want to see it. <laughs> Wait, he's seriously the hospital whore? And who is this lady? They said her name earlier and I don't even remember what it was. Shoot, but I like her. She was an organ donor. Oh wow, so she's actually dead. You could direct the heart to yourself. <gasps> is he gonna do it? Can't they wait a couple days? I don't know. Away. Exactly. Just... Like give him a couple days, hours. Ooh, why are the girls? Oh, so sorry. Excuse me. <laughs> no, no, okay? no apology necessary. <laughs> oh, everybody I'm likes him, huh? Yeah, just... So everybody hates uh McSteamy because he's a whore, but everyone loves McDreamy because he's like really lovable like guy next door kind of. Ah, Derek Shepard. Oh, Derek. Okay, Very Derek Shepard. Nice gotcha. Mm, look at Meredith. Do they know she's that? Pretty. Him and Meredith? Yeah, like Why is she asking him? I can be cheerful. I think the ashes thing makes that kind of unlikely. Oh, gagged you. <laughs> Read you down. And I need to not attend the wedding of Derek Shepard and Sydney Harris. <laughs> How did she jump to that conclusion? Why are they sitting together? That's a lot of drama. <clears throat> Mm-hmm. Like, you think shit is sweet? Uh-uh. In love together. Sexy love, not sibling love. <laughs> what does that mean? Oh, I get what she's saying, but that was a weird way to phrase it, Merida. Whole time? Just once. Yeah. But you were still cheating on your wife who also works there. That's their co-worker and probably friend. <laughs> Callie, that's my girl. Thank you. What's her name? We still haven't figured it out. I just know Dr. Yang. Is her name Susan? Christina! I had to look up my girl's name. Dr. Christina Yang. Again, is this man on call? Is he on break? Why is he sleeping there? Me. Morgan can get on a few minutes, but again, you were trying to clock that girl at the beginning. I don't like this man. Are they cheating too? It kind of seems like it. I don't even know these two and they're kind of like not my faves right now. 
We're getting a lot of scenes though. Baby wakes up all the time. Why are we talking about babies? Is that his baby? Yeah, I'm not feeling these two. I don't know what it's a I don't know what that's about, but I ain't feeling them. Hmm. Interesting. I just met them. Trouble talking a hard patient into taking a heart. Oh, this is girl. Hard. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> she said, and what about it? <laughs> Who is that lady? She's my patient. Are they rivals, Christina and whatever her face is? I think you'll be able to impress me the way you've impressed your mentors in the past. Uh, I. What? What? You sleep with them, right? What? Preston, my oh. theory is if uh, why would she say that? In the OR, you wouldn't need to try to impress in the bedroom. What? Stevens, is it? It is. Let's go, Stevens. So she gets in trouble because she knows the people that she's sleeping with, right? But Stevens is sleeping with one of her, sleeping with one of her coworkers. Aren't they both doing the same thing? She just knows that she should sleep with her superiors and that she can get where she wants to be. I'm sorry, but Dr. Yang is more strategic and calculated than this girl over here just ruining a marriage. Don't do my girl Christian like that. Don't call her a whore, but then you got another whore sitting next to her. <laughs> Again, I don't care who these people sleep with, but. Come on now. Mm, mm, mm. I'm just going to call it racism and move on. <laughs> Transplant team is in place if you're ready to say goodbye. Mm, she's so rude and like you must not have children. detached. Exactly. If you had children, you'd never say that. Exactly. Say, if she's you're ready to say goodbye. Because why would you come in like that? Like so abrasive. I'm very sorry for your loss. No, you ain't. I don't like her either. Page me when he's ready. Dr. Han? Wait, she said page me when he's ready. I also know that she would want you to have her heart. <laughs> they said by this episode, we want this squared away. This man will have his daughter's heart. But like, give him a day. Ooh. It's not my fault Han chose me. Robert. Yang does I not like Steven. If Yang does not like her, then I don't thing. like her either. It's exactly How about that? Thing. Okay, okay, wait, 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 wait. She's right, she's right. It is the same thing. So that means that Dr. Yang, she should still be on the surgery like you are thank you for pointing out the double standards with that dr han i'm sorry that i hurt callie i didn't mean to hurt her okay but I you were cheating her husband exactly I slept with my boyfriend it's not the same oh. thing meredith Clock slept it. with another woman's husband what meredith slept with another woman's husband girl does that look like you are like this meredith? Sir, asking you to just Cut me an inch of slack. Girl, I ate your mama. If you were sorry, you wouldn't have been cheating. He would have broken off. A circle. We just don't like you. You are. Don't let her get the last word. Mm. Here were she come back. Shepherds in your lineage. I'm sorry, what? Girl, get out of my face. Why are you asking me about sheep? <laughs> <laughs> yes, payback's a bitch. Wait, what the hell oh, he set her up to that. Let's call your mom, kid. You're gonna get some ears. Oh, this is really sweet of Meredith. Oh, why did I keep showing this man's foot? Please. Cut off his. I had the world's shortest marriage. Aww. Why are we talking about this in surgery, though? Like, I feel for you, right? But please pay attention. I was wondering if they did surgery and left all the drama behind, but they just bring the drama to the surgery table. I should have known. I was left in a church while I was literally wearing a wedding dress. Hmm. Aww. <laughs> Dr. Yang almost got married and that man left her and now she has to deal with people like Dr. Han. I'm not feeling very <gasps> No! Norms! Norms, if you cannot handle your job, why are you there? Again, why is it made a slate? I must have missed, I must have missed. I must have been talking when they said that he was on break or something because, mm. I intern, something happened. See what I mean? Who is this guy? Do y'all like him or not? Let me know because I'm not feeling him. Y'all see this whole reaction. I ain't feeling him. My girl, you're you're good. You're a Colin. You're good. Him? Don't like you. Who is this guy? I don't even know his name. Don't check it out. Girl, stop begging. I thought we got over that. That man is so fine. Off. Oh my god. I'm actually pretty. Thought she said it was rude to knock on people's doors and beg for food. You know something I didn't expect? I didn't expect um. Ellen's voice to be like that. I don't know what I thought. I thought it would maybe be like a little deeper, but she has like a cute little lisp or something. Now what's wrong with Norman? Why is he on the table now? <gasps> okay, so they are doing the heart transplant. Oh my god. That's what it looks like. Is your marriage really over? Girl, of course it is. Yeah. Why are you asking him that, Meredith? Oh, that's not Meredith. Her mom's ashes 
have you just missed everything that's going on today? Why are you asking these questions? You were right next to everybody when all this happened. Who is this girl? You seem a little clueless. Why don't you go home? Stop waiting for that man. I don't think he's any good anyway. He might be. I, I'm just thinking he's not. Is it gonna start back beating? Oh, there it went. That was a little scary. Got my mom's cat. Oh, girl. Why? Why are you telling me this? My mom didn't leave any instructions. Oh, her mom passed away. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I was like, what? Reburied her right beside my mom. Oh, but that was sweet. I like her. She does seem a little clueless sometimes, but I like her. Who is she? Tucker, I said I'm sorry. No, I didn't. Is she the only one with a good marriage? She's trying to help a little boy. Oh my god, does she get divorced like later in the seasons or is she still with her husband? I hope she is. Because these people in their relationships don't seem good. Sorry, disappointed you. You're apologizing to her? Uh, I have to apologize to her now too. So you apologize to her, but you forgot your own mama? Oh, Mally. Oh, Mally, I don't think I like you either. It takes two to reach <laughs> the point you reach. Uh, uh, no, but it, it takes two to ruin a marriage. Yep, so you and Dr. Blondie. I keep forgetting these people's names, y'all. I swear I'm paying attention, but I don't pick up on names that fast. So yeah, it's the two of y'all's fault. Not my girl Callie. I remember my girl Callie's name, Dr. Bailey, Christina, Meredith. I remember my girl's names, yes, but people I forget, I don't like y'all. I simply didn't make it home. Oh. And that makes me the bad guy. You know what? I bet it takes a lot to be in a relationship with the doctor, especially a surgeon because they do have to save lives, but then their personal life, which just always gets in the way, you know? So I get what she's saying and I get like her husband's perspective, but oh. So is this like foreshadowing that her and her husband are not together? Y'all let me know, or maybe don't let me know. Maybe I'll be able to see it in a future episode. When you came back from Vegas, married after a week. So him and Kelly got together after a week of knowing each other or what? Cause if that's the case, then like, I won't say I get the cheating, but like I get it because did you guys even have that foundation yet? Hmm. Drury's still out for me if he's a bad guy or not. But this lady, she's a bad lady. Don't like her. She's very judgmental and rude. I did not sleep my way to the top. Get her, Christina. I'm attracted to a talent that resembles my own. Not Ooh. that it's any of your business. Get your her. comments were unprofessional mm -hmm. and inappropriate. Mm -hmm. You know what? You're inappropriate and unprofessional. Get her. Don't don't keep repeating yourself. This but is gonna get be her. so much fun. What is? Dr. Han has agreed to become our new head of cardiothoracic surgery. Oh. Looking forward to it, Dr. Yang. Don't like that lady, but Dr. Yang, you can take her. Don't you worry. You can't have my apartment. <laughs> Not she revoked the apartment. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go into psych. <laughs> Please. <laughs> They're all just a bunch of little children running around with your scalpels. Mm -hmm. Inappropriate sex in inappropriate Hello. places. Hello. Call him out because you Bloody were just doing trick. all of that too. I like that guy. Back to the sea is better when you're coming. He's really giving this grown lady advice on what to do with her mom. Mm -mm, Meredith, get together a little bit. I have to start dating. Oh, so him and Meredith aren't together. Right, were they ever together at this point? Well, she's still there. Girl, stand up. Oh, she's gone. Oh, she's letting Cassie stay with her. And if I clean up a little. Yes. <laughs> is Christina okay? Why is she living like that? No, you could have just went to the ocean. Why? Now she's gonna be with like all the gunk in the sewer. What is she? Meredith, stop her. Please, Chief, stop her. Is where she'd want to she's be. She's literally about to be in the sewer with all of the disgusting stuff. Don't, don't, do not go along with this. They're acting like this is like symbolic, but this is horrible. Didn't they not understand that she's gonna go to a sewer? I would be so upset. I can't believe he went along with that. That's. Mm -mm. <laughs> and that's where we end season four, episode five of Grey's Anatomy. Y'all. What was it last shot? But all in all, I do think that I like Grey's Anatomy. I mean, it was definitely more funny than I thought that it was going to be. It also, there seems like there's a lot of drama that goes on in that hospital. I mean, cheating, divorces, flushing mama down the sink. There's a lot that goes on in that hospital, so I may have to tap in. So that was me watching my first ever episode of Grey's Anatomy, and for it to be a random episode was so fun, honestly. I love that I was basically able to make up little stories about everyone and then decide in the split moment if I like someone or not. And if I'm wrong or right, y'all don't jump me in the comments. Just 
just all for fun. Y'all let me know all the tea about these characters because like I said, I was just making up stuff and coming up with my own first impressions and coming up with their own storylines and trying to piece together what I learned from the episode. You guys let me know who your favorite character is. If y'all like my new Dice Decides episode series, please let me know what other TV show you think I should watch. And maybe I'll choose one of your picks for the next episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in another Dice Decides episode video.